Greetings, fellow mortals, and gaze upon the fate that awaits us all. This is my newest uh, skull puppet cat, uh, model. I'm about to make a mold out of it. It's got all the definition that I could put into it without damaging my sanity. <laughs> so I simplified a few things. I made the eye sockets and uh, areas less deep to limit the undercuts and simplify the mold making and casting processes. I tried to include every bone I could, you know, counting the, pos the simplif simplification, of course. There's a little bit of texturing and even the sutures on the skull are very visible so once this is painted and antiqued it's gonna look fantastic so if you've always wanted a skull that's a little bit out of the ordinary but still close to reality this is it he's actually stretched out as you can see because he needs to fit with Punch and Judy puppets that I made he is the newest member of my selection uh, my own design of the Punch and Judy cast of characters so starting in July he'll be available as copies to whomever wants to buy one from me and the good news is I can totally customize so we're talking you know cutting open the cutting the jaw separately and positioning it at whatever position you need it could be a screaming skull it could be neutral like this you could even have a dislocated jaw it could have damages you could have horns a tongue coming out you can have some little eyeballs I had one lying around earlier I just don't know where they went Because once you put a once you put an eyeball in a skull, it automatically makes something a little bit more comical. You can even put a little uh, dot in there, just for the purpose of this video, of course, create a more cartoony look. So that's another option. Everything is uh, not everything, but a whole lot of things are possible. I can even turn it into an articulated puppet. The jaw would be able to speak at the push of a trigger. So I've done this before. It's very easy, and I can make it happen for you if that's what you need. So um, let's talk possibilities. You can contact me at creaturist at gmail dot com, and uh, this is a punch, of course. So they're all based on Mr. Punch in terms of size and proportions. So right now, available, I have Punch, Judy, and the Crocodile. You can see them in other videos on this very YouTube channel, and soon, of course, uh, I'm making the mold uh, today or tomorrow for the skull. So starting in July, I'll be able to offer you copies of it. The first copy is going to a customer already. That's why I need to focus on this and another contract I have. Thank you for watching, and uh, if you have any questions, you know what to do.